Muy buenas a todos muchachadas, estamos en una nueva guía de Gungnir Games El juego es MacRunner Dark Pulse No sé si se dice así <risas> Mi inglés es horrible MacRunner Dark Pulse No, en gabacho no Ahora vamos a empezar una nueva partida El juego se supone que tiene los subtítulos en español No sé qué pasa, que no sé, no, no puedo ponerlos no sé, me pasa esto a veces con juegos y no tengo ni puta idea de por qué es. Si se cambia este archivo tal para poder... Nada. No. No me va. Bueno, nueva partida. He jugado 5 minutos para ver cómo es el juego y poco más. Vamos allá. I am Gamachi. Mutant. Inventor. Scientist. For you to understand. I need to start at the beginning. In the 21st century, the Glukersberg Corporation rose to a position of world dominance. By 2035, their LifeNet total existence network had linked billions of people across the globe, encompassing social, economic, government, private and public services within one monstrous, ever-evolving system. With LifeNet, and the corporation's vast financial resources, Glukersberg accomplished what governments could only hope for, a worldwide populace that wanted to conform, and that was willing to sacrifice privacy for security, safety, and interaction. <laughs> Glukersberg pooled tens of thousands of scientists together to find a new source of free energy to be used for space exploration. The result was magnetic technology. Krukersberg's space program would be a three-month test of not only magtech, but also citizen explorers, astronauts chosen from the populace. After worldwide selection trials that tested the applicants' athletic capabilities and knowledge of mathematics, physics, and psychology, Seven candidates were chosen Siete personas han entrado aquí. Mm. Y nosotros seremos una. Selected from scientists, athletes and civilians would take Glukersberg's technology to the stars. Glukersberg called them his mag runners. A 500,000 square foot training facility filled with puzzles and physical obstacles was built over the San Andreas Rift. The world watched and waited. This young man is Dax Seaward. Dax's father, like me, was an expert in genetics and cybernetics. One of the few who had no compunctions about working with a mutant. James and his wife Lavinia became my closest friends. <laughs> When the accident happened, Dax was left in my care. I raised the boy the best I could. And he soon began to show signs of his father's brilliance. Dax had an aptitude for robotics, genetics, engineering. He read everything he could about Krukersberg's magtech and began to apply the same principles to creating his own technology. By the time he was 11, he had started his own business, repairing and creating new devices. By the time he was 15, he had built and programmed the Newton prototype, a one-of-a-kind electromorph robot. So I suppose that I shouldn't have been surprised when he told me on his 23rd birthday that he wanted to apply for the Krukersberg Magtech program. He had the skills and he had the brain for it. As we completed work on his custom maglav, he was ready. Joder. Pues parece que sí que nos han elegido para ser uno de los siete. El juego tiene su My friends, thank you for joining us today. Today, Grukesburg Magtech is proud to unveil our space exploration training facility. Today is the first day of a three-month training program. De tres meses. That will prepare our mag runners for space exploration. At our facility, they will not only experiment with magtech, but also learn to work and live together <coughs> as they forge our future. Now, let's hear a few words from Xander Deverin, 
the creator of the facility and genius I've spent considerable time and energy designing the testing facility with functional examples of our new technology during training periods contestants will find their bodies and minds pushed to the limits we will see what they can accomplish individually and later what they are capable of as a group o sea, primero nos van a probar individualmente sure y luego en grupo online to see history in the making brought to you by the same minds responsible for the life net after a quick briefing our seven mag runners are preparing to enter the facility for the first time it's almost showtime dex hay brazos i made it here Now the real training starts. The Mag Runners training will be the most important three months of their lives. They will pit their skills and wits against the brilliant Mag Tech engineer Xander Deveran, who will evaluate their progress. We've been allowed into the facility for the first 24 hours, and we're bringing it to you live. Se lo van a retransmitir en directo. Es el tipo gran hermano. Stay focused and remember why you're here. Newton and I will be following on the life net. Newton igual es el perrito. Pues no, Kamaji, we're talking about going into space if I pass the training. It's hard to believe. If your parents were here, I know. Una taza de ser los jóvenes. Be sure to test out the new maglev before you start. Ready, Xander? Ready. Let's begin. Good luck, Dax. Right. Stay focused. O sea, entre zona y zona siempre suele haber un tiempo de carga. El juego se basa en más o menos en lo que sería Portal. Pero la diferencia es que esto tiene más por el, el magnetismo. O A sea, los polos. Los polos opuestos se repelen y los polos, los mismos polos se atraen. Básicamente esa es la teoría en este juego. O sea que si lo pones verde y aquí rojo, pues... Ajá. A ver, este, el primer puzzle es bastante sencillo. El prota ya quiere saber cómo van el resto y lleva aquí cinco minutos. Cinco puñetas los minutos y ya quiere saber. Grande. Bueno, ya a partir de aquí ya no tengo ni idea de qué pasará. How did Xander develop this stuff? Just focus on your training. I'm going to limit our transmissions to the elevators between levels. There's less interference. Ah, vale, lo pillo, lo pillo. Y me monto encima. ¿Puedo montarme encima? Sí. Ajá. Eh, básicamente este juego es eh, un plagio rico de Portal, pero con otra historia. Una historia que en teoría podría ser hasta mejor. Dax, Cassandra Shin from LifeNet Media. Can you give us a few thoughts Aunque about lo dudo today? bastante. How do you feel about being the only mag runner without outside corporate funding or professional training? Do you think you're at a disadvantage? What? I have a trainer. That would be the mutant we've heard about, Gamaji. Yeah. Sorry, Mission. I have to go. <laughs> o sea, básicamente el resto de participantes han tenido entrenamiento privado y y del bueno. O sea, y además se los han costeado con, con inversores y tal. Nosotros somos el único loser que apenas ha tenido alguien confiando en nosotros. Para la gente. Hmm. 
Ah, vale, ahora lo pillo. que tenga idea puede que sí Me espera primero ponerlos aquí directamente ya puede ser sí sí vamos a ver Did you feel like an underdog during the selection trials? Underdog. <laughs> What? They're all underdogs, Miss Shin. The training is discovery-based, and I will not tolerate less than 100% commitment to the program. Look, Miss Shin, I have the same chances as the other mag runners at passing. I don't see why you keep... Same chances? Joder, qué buena gente. Cómo se ríe la agonía. Right. I'll tell you what, Dax. How about an exclusive interview and the front page of LifeNet Science Online? Uh, sure. Yeah. No, nadie confía en nosotros. Qué buena gente. Buena gente. Se murieron todos. Buena gente. <risa> pues un poco cabronía, eso que no confían en nosotros, pero absolutamente nada. At least there's lots of food. Como que comida le dice. Tengo dos cubos. No creo que se rompan así, pero... No, no llegan a romperse. No. Ahí va, ahí va. Igual si sí puede funcionar.
pero es que no se no pillo muy bien como que tengo que hacer. O sea, ahí arriba no. Lo primero que hay que hacer es romper el cristal este, pero ¿cómo lo rompo? En el aire no se les puede dar. Te timo. Te timo. Ah, amigo. Ahora sí. No me mato ni nada. Genial. Volveremos a esta escena. Ah, oh, pues no, pues es otro puzzle. Gumaji, are they off the calm? Yes. There's something wrong with that Zander guy. Don't listen to him. And what did that reporter mean by that mutant? Yeah, she's kind of a pain, huh? She's just digging for an interview to make Grukesberg look good. Keep your head on. Vale, no veo ni un. Ahí va. Is this part of the training? Hoy va. Yo no he tocado nada. Yo he sido. Is everyone all right? No injuries. Bios are good. Dander, what happened? A minor power fluctuation, Mr. Grukesberg. I've ensured that it won't happen again. Vale. Uh. vale, ahora lo pillo. Empieza a pillarlo. O oh, no, no empieza a pillar. Es un cubo mágico. Y con lanzar esto aquí que gano. Nada. Nada porque no sé cómo... Cómo ir, así que... Funciona así. Me tendría que haber montado en el cubo, sí. 
Y puedo pedir otro, espera. Ahí abajo desaparece, genial. Al cubo se meterá aquí y podemos traer. Vale, vale, vale. Tengo que cruzar al otro lado. roja pues esta la tengo que poner verde ahora no. no quiero morir ah, no era tan difícil Pues eso que ha pasado ahí, el, el cambio de energía o lo que sea, a saber. Ves que hay una historia más oscura en el juego. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we've suffered a minor technical glitch, but we are now back online. Os vuelta a estar online. It's sting, Grukesber. With the live audience, too. Not exactly a solid recommendation for a new product, no. Hold on, Dax. Something's changed in the algorithms that Sanders used to run the facility. Todo. The system log shows a reboot. What? Gamaji, did you hack into the testing facility? Sander's interface is amazing. It integrates all the functions and accessibility of the LifeNet with his biofeedback response to influence the MagTech. Oh, you're gonna get me kicked out. <laughs> Relax, Dax, I'm masked. He thinks I'm just another peripheral. Uh, oh, no. No, he's blocked yeah, me. Yeah, um... Lo ha hackeado el gamay anyway, este. He's too busy to run a trace. Y lo han pillado, pero no saben qué ha sido él. Por lo menos por ahora, luego seguro que lo pillarán. Vamos, fijísimo. Bueno, lo vamos a dejar en este puzzle. Y continuaremos en el siguiente vídeo. Por ahora es un juego que pinta bastante bien, puede ser muy interesante. Y bueno, nos vemos en el siguiente vídeo. Hasta ahora, hi hi.